Okay, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to hook up and connect your EMG controller. First thing we're gonna do is make sure we have a USB cable plugged in to our computer. And then we're gonna plug that directly into our Arduino. Obviously you see it light up. So we got power, you heard it connect to the computer. So we're looking good. Next thing we wanna do is make sure we select the right device from the drop-down menu, click connect. I'm gonna go ahead and have this in graph mode. And as that's working on auto scaling, what I'm gonna do is connect the electrodes to my body. You can connect these to any muscle group you want. I like to start out with this muscle group here. And then we put one on the back of the wrist, back of the hand. So the black lead is gonna go on the back. And the other two leads, doesn't matter which way you do it, need to go over here. Okay. And now you are measuring your EMG signal of your muscle. You can get an idea of what your EMG controller components are doing depending on where they are on the PCB board. One thing to note is you can modify the sensitivity of your EMG controller with this potentiometer. So typically if you turn it counterclockwise, what's gonna happen is it's gonna become more sensitive and if you turn it clockwise, it's gonna be less sensitive. What I like to do is start all the way clockwise, so turn it as far right as I can, and then increase the sensitivity as needed by turning the potentiometer counterclockwise. And obviously the graph itself scales, auto scales. You can turn that off if you don't want that to auto scale so you can see the impact of the sensitivity a little bit. Another thing to make sure, always make sure that this is plugged in all the way. Sometimes I get students who leave it like that and it's not gonna work properly if you do that. You'll still see something being traced out but you're not getting signal. So you gotta make sure that's plugged in all the way. Okay, we hope you have a great time with your EMG controller. Have some fun, enjoy it. In the next video, I'm gonna go through some different things we can look at with an O-scope on our EMG controller.